Hello and welcome back to Gapy's Bee Yard. It's been a while since I've submitted a, an update on my bees. I had one of my two colonies survive the winter this year and the other one died from, I'm pretty sure, Nazima. But the remaining hive, this is a hybrid bee, so they're a lot darker than my other hive, which was Italian's. And it seems like the hybrids or carniolans do a lot better here in Washington. So I think I'm gonna stick with with those type of bees and not do the Italians anymore. So this is the first hive I've had survive the winter and I'm looking forward to hopefully getting my first maple honey flow. That's one of the, the main honey flows here in Washington, um, aside from blackberry and knotweed. But weather depending, um, if it's gonna be rainy like it has been, I may not get much of a honey flow. But I'll be putting my supers on probably today or later this week so that they can start preparing the comb for the flow and right now the the hive is three boxes high and they're all medium boxes and it's pretty full with bees so I think after the maple honey flow I'm gonna do a split and then I'll have two hives again and I'm, I'm gonna set out my nuke also and hopefully try and get a swarm from my neighbors bees. I did just start feeding these guys yesterday. I put two pints of sugar syrup in the top and I added some Nazivit, which I've heard is a really good um, medicine or, or supplement for reducing the chance of them getting Nazima. So I'm hoping that will do the trick. Um, and it's, an, it's a natural, naturally made with essential oils and things, so it should be pretty safe. Anyway, I just thought I'd give a, a quick update. They're bringing in lots of pollen today because we've had a really nice day and we haven't had very many of those. So they're all coming out for their cleansing flights and bringing in lots of pollen. So I will talk to you guys again soon. Thanks for watching.